Okay, and how does a manager start this journey? How do they assess which technology partner they might like to work with? I think the key thing with any partner selection is to not tie yourself in, right? Especially with PE firms, hedge funds, you, you need to be as flexible as possible. And so I think it's very important to find a partner that's going to allow you to tip your toe in the water, um, not have some three-year contract for implementing a massive tool that, that you may or may not need. Um, we, for example, run an accelerator program, which is essentially like a proof of concept. Um, we go in, we train the staff on the dashboarding tools. We utilize our Snowflake data warehousing tools where we have uh, an environment that allows us to run it for free for a period of time under our Snowflake tenants um, to really just show them what they can have, give them market insight into what we're doing with other firms of uh, similar strategy and size. And then they can decide whether that's a useful route for them to go before they really dive in heavily. Um, that, that would be the core advice, I think. Take someone who's done it and has good experience, obviously, but try not to tie yourself into these things because especially with data warehousing and Power BI dashboards and tableaus and things, they're all subscription-based. And most of these manufacturers and providers want to have at least a 12-month term. You may not need it. So doing a proof of concept or dipping your toe in is, is the best approach. George, thank you for joining us. Thank you.